Tigers still with a two-point lead here. 4.23 left to go. Mohammed off the steal. Looking inside. Be beautiful feed underneath. And the basket is good by Asiatu Bangura. Well, we just mentioned that O'Brien, the entire O'Brien team in white are all eighth graders. Uh, that that could be an advantage, just experience-wise. You say experienced middle school as well. <laughs> Some young girls don't do play, uh, but don't play organized until either AAU program, a church program, or like this middle school program. And when you look at it, uh, Orchard Gardens is much more of a mix. They have four seventh graders, and they have uh, three sixth graders blended in with their eighth graders. Off the inbounds pass. Nice pass aside. Basket no good there for Orchard Gardens. Bangura comes away with the rebound for O'Brien. Another good feed inside, and they score off the window. And the O'Brien team at this point, and, you know, when you need an Orchard Park, Orchard Gardens is a timeout. The O'Brien team is just getting those passes inside much too easy. Uh, the, the girls, and, and, and what's, what's good, uh, even though they're all eighth graders, they're looking for the pass, they're expecting the pass, and they're ready to shoot as soon as they get it. I can remember years ago, when we started doing these games, Pat, through the first quarter, first half, we'd have more turnovers than points. That's right. This is not the case today. I mean, this O'Brien team, like I said, will repeat it probably throughout the game. All eighth graders makes a big difference. That's right. So far, these first five minutes, we're seeing that. Yep, Kendra Alexander with the last basket there before the timeout here. We get a nice look from Mohammed to Alexander. Good job. Alexander made it, got, made her way into the lane, but made sure that she didn't stay in too long. Pass came right to her. Easy layup. 